my name is Zuri. Hi, my name is Stacey Ann, and we are in our car just now. We're actually doing the drop off for school, and we're sitting here discussing, among other topics, death. Um, so, if you have someone who's dying, or you have somebody who died, um, one, we're very sorry to hear that because losing someone is very hard. Well, somebody who was a great, great person to us, I don't know about you, but. This person died a long time ago. He was Martin Luther King. Martin Luther King, okay. He got shot, I think. He did get shot because he was fighting against racial segregation. Yes. Mm -hmm. And we read, read the book. He had a son. He did have a son, yes. At the store. Mm. And, he's, and that son mm -hmm. saw... The, saw a sign. I don't remember what it said, but I I know what he he felt something in him. Mm -hmm. Like he felt I think he he felt something I think like Was this sign about racial segregation? I think so. Did it say something about where white people should go and where black people should go and where white people were allowed to go but black people were not allowed to go there mm -hmm. okay so like and so he felt this and he felt like in his real he felt ev he felt in his heart mm -hmm. like he felt something like did he feel what what did he feel did he feel like it was a good thing the sign he felt i think he felt like He felt, he felt, I think he felt very, like, sad, mm -hmm. like, cause it was about, like, kind of, I think it was about, like, brown people can't go together. Or they can't go into particular stores, or they can't use this bathroom, they can't drink from this fountain. And they can't get water and stuff mm -hmm. I don't know what the sign said mm -hmm. but I remember how he felt mm -hmm. and I remember that it was a great story but at the end he got shot not the sun well I think that you're you're thinking about what made I think that in Martin Luther King's past when he was a child he saw these signs all the time and then he grew up to be an activist who fought against racial segregation. And that fight, that commitment to that fight, is what got him killed in the end. And I think that's what you feel the sadness about. But I think, on the other it's hand... It's great when people die sometimes, but it's a little, like, sad. I don't know if it's, it's great, but I think that if people die fighting for a cause they believe in, then... I don't know if I can't celebrate their life anyways. I would have to celebrate a person who fought their whole life to end racial segregation. I would have to. And, and I think that, I don't think it's really great, but I think it's, it's, it's in between some things. Yeah, yeah. Like, you get to see what's, you get to. Like, when you're dead, you can see, you can, like, see inside, you can see inside the world, see inside your heart. Wow. I, 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 I don't know for myself if that is true, but you certainly have the room to believe it, and there are lots of people who believe that. And so that belief is I am solid. believing it right now, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. and I am feeling it. Okay. I can feel feel it as as I talk mm -hmm. how about you you know I, I feel the passion you feel and I admire it deeply and I think it's wonderful but we gotta get you to school <laughs> <laughs> thank you for watching folks um, thank you for being voyeur to our to some of our conversations toodaloo we, um, we love the feedback you know from people when we have conversations after um, but thank you for watching. Loads of love.
All right. You want to say bye? Lots of love. Of love. <laughs> Bye, people.